Good morning. We're so thankful you've decided to worship with us. We understand this is a little bit out of the ordinary, but we also know that God's Spirit cannot be constrained by the walls of a building and that He is working through us as we worship together. Please join us this morning as we sing praises to God, take part in communion, read scripture, spend time in prayer, and listen to a message from God's Word. If you have any needs or special requests, please be sure to let the church office know. Please remember to join us in our annual 40 Days of Prayer. Prayer guides are available in a link in the weekly Westgate On The Go email or by clicking the bar at the top of our webpage. We hope everyone will join us in this church-wide time of refocus, dedication, and prayer that will lead us into Easter. Tsutomu Yamaguchi was a 29-year-old engineer in Japan. On August 6, 1945, he was preparing to head back home after a three-month business trip in Hiroshima. On the way to the station, however, he realized he forgot an item at his workplace and went back to retrieve it. Upon returning to the station, the American bomber Enola Gay dropped an atomic bomb only three kilometers away from Yamaguchi. He was left with burns, ruptured eardrums, and temporary blindness from the ordeal, but he survived and was able to return to his hometown of Nagasaki. Yamaguchi reported back to work three days later and was describing the experience to a supervisor. While talking to him, the American bomber boxcar dropped another atomic bomb, this one also just three kilometers away from Yamaguchi. Incredibly, he survived this blast as well and is the only person officially recognized as having survived both explosions. In Deuteronomy, we are encouraged to be strong and courageous. God will never leave you nor forsake you. Our hope is that when this pandemic is over, we will all be able to look back and share our experiences of survival and isolation. The fact of the matter, however, is that we are never truly alone. God is always with us and will never leave us or forsake us. Please join us as we sing praises to God. 